Listen, no cicadas. It's so quiet. I know I'm not going crazy because they used to be much louder here. Here's two examples. My mom's <laughs> sister's husband, my godfather is your uncle. And now they seem to have gone away. Do they need humidity? Because it's not humid today and I just can't hear them. Anyway, it's almost 20 hours at home. Too long. Here, listen to this, guys. Nice and quiet. A little sound. Nice and quiet. And... Can you hear it? What should I do? Should I service this thing? If I service it, it's gonna be a long time without it. And no flying. And we're going to some really cool places soon. I don't wanna be without a drone. She's back! If it's going to fail, today is not the day yet. You're such a good Airstream driver! I had a good teacher, David. Yourself? You! You taught me. I don't teach anybody how to drive Airstream, I can barely do it myself. <laughs> you taught me. Every time she comes back without an incident, I'm so happy. I'm gonna bring Robert a pack of Mentos. You're gonna bring Robert a pack of Mentos? Yes. Why did he have a bad breath? No, because he gave me one of his mints. And I don't want this on the film. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. He, no, what I was going to say was he said he only gives mints. Don't put this on there. I am. He only gives mints to people he likes. So I want to be nice and give him a whole pack of mints. Wouldn't you that be nice? You have nice, uh, what you call it, lifelines on your hand. Oh my god, I have a lot of lines on my hand. What are they, fortune telling lines or something? They're wrinkles. <laughs> That's what they are. They're not wrinkles. It, yes, they are. At your age, they're definitely not wrinkles. I've had wrinkly hands since I was a teenager. Or even before. That's just when I paid attention to it. They've they're not been. wrinkly. They're, they are wrinkly. They have defined surface. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there is. If you look it up, you can tell it's one like this one. But there's a fork in mine. This is where you came oh, along. Oh, that's where we are right now. <laughs> that's oh, where that's where along. I came along? Yeah. <laughs> I'm the fork. <laughs> <laughs> You're the fork. Hello, I'm David the fork. <laughs> that's the name of this episode. David the fork? Yeah. <laughs> Literally the last rays of sun during the day. I'm such a sunset sucker. Do you smell this chocolate? I smell chocolate. There's a cocoa factory here. There's a cocoa factory? Mm -hmm. And I didn't know about this? You can only smell it sometimes, like today you definitely can't. Maybe. Because what, they have the uh, cocoa press on today? They must. If video could convey smells, this would be the most pleasant episode that we ever shot. Because right now, in this very parking lot, the air around me is smelling like chocolate. This cocoa factory, whatever they're doing today, it smells like heaven. We just stopped to get some groceries on our way to another campground. And now I have to go in there and get some milk chocolate or I won't be able to exist anymore. Be strong, David. That looks way too sinful. We're not getting that.
most campgrounds offer so-called late check-in which means you basically come in register yourself fill some basic information out camping sites available tonight one night only all set up and ready to camp the never-ending adventure for Bronnie and David continues this really pretty campground is called Killens Pond and it is close to Ocean City when we did an engagement session for Karen and Charles just recently in Ocean City I did not think we would be coming back so soon but tomorrow is a really important day for us we're meeting up with a person that's really well known among wedding photographers so we're gonna say good night to you guys and we will see you tomorrow Maybe David the Fort. Maybe David the Fart. <laughs> you know what you did to me? You made me want chocolate and now I won't it be able... It does smell really good, doesn't it? I know, it's crazy. Maybe we got that chocolate we wanted from here. <gasps> we should look. In search for milk chocolate.